Hey guys, working on a Volkswagen Mach 1 here. Uh, basically 1979 and up all the way to the Cabriolet. In this video, I am going to show you in depth how all this goes on. Okay, so first thing is on the brake cylinder here. See how there's like a little step on there? So those steps uh, go like that. They stick out on both sides. So that's step number one. Um, as far as uh, your shoes go, so, right, they're gonna go on like this. See, there's like a, like a thing on this one. So this one goes on like this. And the one with the emergency brake, that one goes on like that. Okay, I'm gonna set some stuff up here. So I got new, uh, shoes from Rock Auto, and I got all these things from Rock Auto as well. Very well priced. Okay, see you in a few minutes. Okay, so now this part, this is basically the only part we're uh, reusing, right? So, I grabbed one of these springs, this thing here, right? So on this pad, see with this thing on it, or shoe I mean, right? So this is going to go in into this hole see that see like that right and then this thing goes like this see that right and then you hook this gets hooked around that so let me hook that you know what i mean so you pull it over vice grips are the best if you don't have like special tools so just hooks around there okay see you in a second okay see so there it is just like that so now okay so now there's this part see so this see there's like a hole there see that hole so this is an automatic adjuster as the pads wear out or as the shoes wear out this will automatically go down further and further by itself and push this out a little bit more to make up for these being worn out. Um, that is the best way I can explain it. So you just have to put that in just into that hole, just at the bottom because uh, into that hole, just at the bottom because the shoes are new, right? So we're gonna stick that in there. You'll have to like open up the spring and put this in. Okay, so I got it in, see, just like that. So also there's this like little nipple sticking out right here. You see that? So that nipple, so you don't want it on this side. It's gotta be facing, uh, it's gotta be facing this, this little nipple thing right there. Okay, uh, I'll show you what's next in a second. Okay, so now on to this part, see this moving part, right? You're gonna slide in this for the emergency brake. Pretty straightforward, especially if it's disconnected in the front like ours is. Okay, now these three things, obviously. Also guys, uh, I don't know why the kit came with two different lengths. So just pay attention to that. I checked the ones that were on there originally and they're the longer ones. So I'm using the longer ones in my case. Okay, so now we're gonna put uh, the other side on. This spring is hard to get on, so I find it easier to do it like this. Okay, so as you're sliding this in, right? So see right there, there's like a little, right at the tip of my finger, see that thing? So that has to go in behind uh, the emergency brake thing. So what you do is, let's see if I can get this on camera. I'll try. So what you gotta do is, see, you gotta take this, put it down low, see like that. So it gets in behind it. See, and then you bring it up right into that slot there. 
It's not easy, guys, but it will be done. Okay, I'm having a hard time getting this to go in there. I'm gonna take this back off. I mean, I'm trying things just like anybody else would. Okay, guys, I took everything back off. So, see, that there has to go, see, like, around that, and then in there, see? So that way it's, it's on, so. Like I said, I'm, it's not even about how to put this on, it's just the order of things. So that's how that goes. I'm gonna get this spring in and I'm gonna throw this back on, guys. Okay, so the self-adjuster, I pushed it all the way down. This will spread this more. Should be easier to put it on. So let's try this all again. Okay, see how I got all that? Take a good look at it if you need to. Okay, so now this thing, we're gonna push it all the way up again. So you just pull on this, push it up, and then that gets a purple spring, and the spring goes on this way. So you're gonna put one end of it in there, and the other end of it into that hole. Okay, I'm gonna do that right now. Okay guys, so we are down to uh, one last spring. And by the way guys, this is an entire restoration series of a Volkswagen Mach 1 convertible. Step by step, we're putting rims on it, coilovers, redoing everything on it. Um, yeah, check out the playlist. You can see everything in a row get done. Doing the coilovers next guys. Okay, back to the spring. Okay, so that goes from there, like this, through this hole, and it goes to that hole. Okay, I'm going to put that on, then I'll show it to you guys. Okay, guys, there it is. Take a good look. Make sure your emergency brake cable runs underneath that. See, just like this. Um, yeah, take a nice, you can pause it and really, really get a good look here. Try to get some angles in for you. You put your drum on and you are done. Okay guys, well that concludes this video and we're gonna be putting these on guys. Nice big fat tires. If you wanna see that video, subscribe to this channel guys. I'm making these videos for you. Thanks for watching. Till next time everybody.